time spouse family this week we're talking about 29 strategies to grow your business yesterday we talked about working your current and past business customer list following up using risk reversal bumping and upselling and selling and selling again today we're going to talk about steps 6 through 12. one is to utilize host parasite relationships what does that mean I can tell you what it means, but I'm going to read it right from the book so there will be no confusion. A much closer relationship than simply acquiring other people's com other companies' products to sell on the back end. A post-parasite relationship occurs when you enter into a joint venture with another's business and cooperate trying to better exploit on an ongoing basis something you have or that they have now after I explain that those of you that are in business networking international that's what it is B and I you're in this meeting with these people and you're really getting them to open their book of business to you so that's what utilizing host parasite relationships is it's like B&I, joining and getting other people's books of business. Number seven, you can utilize your competitor's resources. So we go out, we do bids all the time. Some of you get a 95% close rate, some of you get a 50% close rate because some people just are getting a price to get a price. And we know that, but we make money off the ones that we do do. So how can you utilize those people? So maybe it's somebody that's wanting windows done and you give them a quote for windows. We're too high. What you can do is have somebody else that you send them to and you get a kickback of some sort for sending them business. Some of the realtors we work with will send them um, business and we get a kickback for that. So you can definitely use your competitor's resources. Another thing, number eight, is utilizing um, extended warranties and guarantees and incentives. What we do at Sometimes Spouse with our cleaning department at home office is we give a 24-hour guarantee. So they go home, they find that the girls missed a ceiling fan, we'll, we'll come out and take care of it as long as they get a hold of us within 24 hours. They can't get a hold of us a month later because um, it just doesn't work that way. But a 24-hour uh, guarantee on our services. Uh, we also do give incentives through the Sometimes Home Plan, a 20% discount for additional services um, at their home. They get uh, sales twice a year, and they also get preferred scheduling. So we have incentives also built into our business. Also, number nine, lock in sales in advance. If somebody calls you for a gift certificate or a special promotion that you're running, get the payment up front. You've locked in that sale. Um, number 10, going out of business. If some of your competitors are going out of business, try to buy their book of business. You can usually buy it for pennies on the dollar. Um, number 11, get customers to give referrals. When you're finished up, you send them the thank you card, call them up and say, hey, I'm glad you were so happy with your services. Do you know anybody else that's needing work like this done? Um, that way you can not have to pay to acquire a new customer. And number 12, um, cat, you can use cash out of your business instead of going to the bank. Um, lots of people have lots of different accounts for their cash or for their business. And instead of going to the bank to get a loan, what you can do is you can utilize that cash that you've just got kind of in other accounts. So of the 29 strat strategies, we went through 12. Number one, work your current list or past list. Number two, follow up. Number three, use risk reversal. Number four, bump and upsell. Number five, sell and sell again. Number six, utilize that host parasite relationship. Number seven, use your competitor's resources and profits. Number eight, offer a guarantee and incentive. Nine, lock in sales in advance. 10, know your company, if you know a company is going out of business, buy their book of business or acquire their customer base. 11, get your customers to give you referrals. And number 12, get cash out of your business before going to the bank. You guys have an amazing day and think about ways every day that you can grow your business.